Corey Hardrick is trying to force Tia Mowry to pay him spousal support, and Tia is not here for it. But you and your husband, like a lot of couples, decided that it was it was better to be lived, your life's better lived apart than together. Yes. Tia Mowry and Corey Hardrick's divorce just took an ugly turn after Corey filed new documents in court challenging the existing prenup and asking Tia to support him financially. So it looks like it's about to get a little messy in the Tia and Corey Hardrick divorce. Apparently, he doesn't agree with the determination that there were irreconcilable differences and could he be contesting their prenuptial agreement? However, it looks like Tia has had enough of Corey using her as a meal ticket, and she recently opened up about her divorce with Corey, calling it an awakening. It, there was just an aha moment in me where I said, you know what, you need to tap in, see what's really going on with your happiness. But what exactly did Corey say in his new court filing? Is he really trying to make Tia pay spousal support? Let's break it down. She met me at my lowest point in Cali when I got out there. I didn't have anything. And she, you know, gave me that ride home on a yeah. bus stop. That was for real. Tia Mowry and Corey Hardrick are getting a divorce after 14 years of marriage. And though Tia initially claimed the separation was friendly, it looks like Corey is now trying to create some major drama. While Corey didn't want to make any public statements about the divorce, he went to court and filed new documents disputing the prenup he signed back in 2008. But that's not all. Corey's new filing also reveals he's planning to ask Tia for spousal support while also asking the court to cancel Tia getting spousal support from him. However, Tia is not not about to let this slide, and she's now speaking out on Corey trying to take her money. Now, before we get into all this, let's go over some context for those who may have missed out on this divorce drama. On October 4th, 2022, Tia shocked her fans when she shared this black and white photo of her and Corey on Instagram and announced that they had decided to go their separate ways. Tia said the decision wasn't an easy one. However, she also claimed she and Corey will remain friends and continue to co-parent their children. I am grateful for all the happy times Times we had together, Tia wrote, and thanked her friends, family, and fans for supporting her and Corey in this new chapter. And while most of Tia's fans reacted with shock and sadness to Tia's divorce announcement, there were also plenty of those who said this relationship was doomed from the start because Tia was the one pulling most of the weight from the beginning. Many fans pointed out that the fact Tia pretty much picked Corey up from off the street was already a red flag. I was waiting on the bus stop. We, we, I was at my first film. Her sister and her drove by, they saw me waiting, they asked me to give me a ride. I was just like embarrassed. I was downtown. Yeah. Gave me a ride and we were friends ever since. Oh cool. Took me to Inglewood. So that's how that relationship started. And yeah. we were friends and we just started dating to nothing. And, um, and then it just went from there. And I was just real, man. Other fans said they always felt Tia was much more into Corey than he was into her, pointing out that Corey's body language in their joint interviews was a telltale sign he stayed in this marriage for selfish reasons. Everything is not perfect, you know? Marriage is work. And that's Marriage is work. Wait, is. I'm not here. Let me go ahead, sorry. I love you too. Today. Yeah, even though she get on my damn nerves. You get on my damn nerves. <laughs> I mean, but that's a part of a relationship, you know? <laughs> I think we're very realistic. And then, after news broke that Tia filed for divorce, several outlets published reports speculating that Tori cheated on Tia. These reports claim that Corey must have been unfaithful because the divorce filing seemed sudden. Because just a week before Tia filed for divorce, she gushed about her trip to Italy with Corey and the kids, and she showed no signs of dealing with any personal issues. To be in Italy with, again, with our children and our husband, it was just so amazing and surreal, surreal and just so wonderful. Just walking down the streets and just having a great time, drinking our spritz, just sharing stories. However, Corey immediately denied allegations about infidelity. And after one fan on Instagram accused him of cheating on Tia, he clapped back and wrote lies. As for Tia, she initially refused to address the media allegations surrounding her divorce, and she only shared one cryptic message on Twitter that read, Reminder, you are enough, you deserve love, and you deserve to be understood for who you truly are. However, as the weeks went by, Tia started dropping hints left and right that Corey was holding her back, sparking speculation that she filed for divorce because Corey wasn't contributing enough to their household. She first shared this clip on Instagram with the message, POV, when you remember Tia. F -U -R. And in the caption, she wrote, Deshaun in the house. Welcome back, queen. When you show for yourself, you glow differently. And then Tia went a step further and pretty much confirmed the speculation about Corey not doing his part to support their family. Tia was caught liking and commenting with the eyes emoji on a video shared by the popular Instagram
Instagram account at Mental Healness that brings awareness to the dangers of narcissistic personality disorder and teaches people how to spot narcissistic traits in their partners. The video Tia commented on shows what happens when you try to call out your toxic partner for not paying any bills and the caption reads, some toxic people will refuse to contribute around the home in any way. After fans spotted Tia liking and commenting on this particular video, they immediately started dragging Corey for using Tia for money and many of them said Tia should have never picked up Corey from that bus stop. Tia built Corey, one fan said. She literally met him at a bus stop and moved him into her apartment. I don't know what happened, but I hope she has a prenup. And speaking of prenups, here's where the story gets even messier. See, Tia and Corey created a prenup before they got married back in 2008. And when Tia filed for divorce last October, she specified in her filing that Corey will not be receiving spousal support. Not only did Corey agree to the terms of this prenup, but he also has enough money to support himself. According to a recent report by People Magazine, Tia has a net worth of $4 million, while Corey has just $1 million less than her in his bank account. But believe it or not, Corey is now trying to challenge the prenup he signed, and he reportedly wants to force Tia to pay spousal support. Radar Online obtained new court documents recently filed by Corey's lawyer, showing that Corey wants the court to determine the validity of the prenuptial agreement dated April 14, 2008. And he's asking the judge to analyze whether any provisions in the prenup are unreasonable. And that's not even the craziest part. In this new filing, Corey also asked the court to block Tia from requesting spousal support, which she never even requested in the first place. But then get this, Corey left the boxes unchecked on whether he is allowed to request spousal support from Tia. However, despite Corey's new filing, it looks like Tia is not going to let anything spoil her newfound freedom. Tia recently gushed about her single life, and she described her decision to file for divorce as an awakening. But you and your husband, like a lot of couples, decided that it was it was better to be lived, your life's better lived apart than together. Yes. Um, how did you know that it was time? Ah, that's a really good question. To take that route? Um I knew when I really started to focus on my happiness. Mm. I feel like women we tend to focus on everybody else's happiness, um, making sure that everybody else is okay, meaning our children. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> Meaning, you know, our children, our friends, our, you know, family. But at the end of the day, it's about self-love. And when you start to really work on yourself, love yourself, know your value, know your worth, and then all of a sudden there's this awakening. Tia said the divorce process is far from easy. However, she also insists that she doesn't regret filing. And as you can see, Tia really does look like a huge burden has been lifted from her shoulders. It's not easy. It's a hard journey. But at the end of the day, I feel like it is so, so worth it, so. Yeah, wow. When asked about her fans' reaction to the divorce announcement, Tia said the fans shouldn't worry about her at all because she made the best decision for herself and she's celebrating the beginning of this new chapter. Because some people, when you say, oh, my husband and I are going our separate ways, they go, oh, no, yeah. oh, that's sad. But you actually see this as a, a celebration. A yeah. celebration. I in the really beginning. do. And despite the fact that Corey is now trying to go after her money, Tia refused to bash her soon to be ex husband and insisted her marriage to Corey was not a failure. You know, m my marriage was a success. Yeah. I look at it as like a curriculum when you're in college or high school, right? You're learning, you're growing, you're evolving, you're creating. And I was able to create with Corey some beautiful, amazing children. Mm -hmm, yeah. And at the end of that curriculum, and at the end, there's a graduation, there's a celebration. But unlike Tia, her fans are not holding back and bashing Corey, and they're calling him out for still trying to leech off of Tia. I can't believe Corey Hardrick is really going after Tia's money after that man ain't even want to financially support the family for the majority of the marriage, one fan said. He doesn't want to give her spousal support, and she doesn't want it from him, and he wants the prenup he signed tossed? Mm. And another Twitter user added, I'm not surprised Corey Hardrick is a dirtbag trying to go after Tia's money and question the validity of the prenup. Seems like she was trying to be fair across the board and he's just greedy. God don't bless no mess. But let's hear what you think about this situation. Do you think Corey has been using Tia for money this whole time? Leave your comments down below. And if you thought this story was messy, make sure you check out this next video.